Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get hundreds of free live TV or IPTV channels on any Roku device running the latest software. I'm using a Roku Streaming Stick 4K, but this will work on any Roku device. Now, many of you following my channel know that I am not a big fan of Roku, and there's many reasons for that. But the reason for me making this video, guys, to be honest, is I know a lot of you have Roku devices, and I just want to provide as much value as I can for those of you who are subscribed to my channel, as I greatly appreciate your support. So to access free live TV on your Roku device, all you need to do is come to the home screen here. So just click the home button on your remote. And if you scroll over apps, you should see an option that says live TV guide. If you don't see this for some reason, you may need to run a system update and I'll show you that at the end of this video. Or you will see an option that says live TV on the Roku channel. Those are two quick ways to start streaming live channels for free. So if I click live TV, you're instantly going to notice a working electronic program guide that has hundreds of free live channels in various categories. Now, if you want access to those categories, click the left button on your remote and you'll see this little menu here. It says all channels, favorites, recommended, recents, and then it gets into the categories. Now, all of these channels are being populated from the Roku channel, which has hundreds of live channels that you can install for free. The Roku channel actually is accessible on the Amazon App Store and Google Play Store as well. It's a great application. So you'll see all the categories here. I'm on sports, movies, news, game shows, comedy, reality, Espanol, music, kids and family, all channels. Um, and some of the notable options here NFL, MLB, NHL, we have some soccer, uh, PGA Tour, Fox Sports, NBC Sports. If I hover over news, we have ABC, NBC, some weather content, Fox Weather, USA Today, Yahoo Finance. Just so many options here, guys, and just a lot of great things that you can choose from in a nice working interface. Now, one of the most important things, too, if you're doing this interface like I'm showing here, is the ability to add channels to your favorites. Now, having all of these channels is overwhelming, and just trust me, guys, there's so many apps that I'm using, and there's so many channels, it's very overwhelming as I only use five to 10 channels on a regular basis. So you'll see there's an option for favorites here. If I hover over favorites and I click this option that says select to add to favorite channels, you're gonna get an option that looks like this where it says manage channels. And if I click favorite channels, I can now scroll through here and just start checking the channels that I want in my favorites. So if I want Weather Nation, I can check that. That's now in my favorites. If I scroll down and I want you know, some news channels or if I want MLB, uh, I'm gonna check MLB, NHL, PGA Tour, Fox Sports, just some channels that I can show you guys. Now that I've added these, all you need to do is click the back button on your remote and then I'm gonna go back to my home screen, launch the live TV guide again. And then once I'm on this interface, I'm going to click the left button on my remote, scroll down and I'm hovered over favorites. And you'll see here are the channels that I added to my favorites. So you can remove these at any time if there's channels you don't want in your favorites anymore. Uh, so let's say I don't want this weather channel in my favorites. If I hit the options button on my remote, click unfavorite this channel and click close, it is now removed from my favorites. So just some quick tips there if you are looking to add and remove channels from favorites. So that's great, right? Now that you have all these hundreds of live channels in a working electronic program guide, but let's say you wanna add even more channels. So all you would need to do is install an application from the Roku channel store that provides free live content. So in this example, I installed Plex. And obviously Plex is available in the Roku channel store as I just installed it. So I do know that this is 100% legal and verified to stream content on. So if I launch Plex, and you can do this for any app, guys, Pluto TV, Tubi, Haystack News. I'm just thinking of some off the top of my head. Any app that provides live content, you can just install it from the Roku channel store. So I'm going to click skip sign up as you don't need an account to start using Plex. And if I hover over live TV, Plex also offers over 100 live channels that you can start streaming on your Roku device. So in addition to that free guide offered by the Roku channel, you can install all of these different applications from the Roku channel store that offer live content. You'll see I'm scrolling through in some of the categories offered by Plex. 
Um, so if there's content on a different app that is not available in the Roku channel, in the Roku channel, you can just install it from the store and then access it within those specific applications. So some great options here from Plex or Ion Television, NBC News Now, uh, some crime channels, Ion AMC, um, and just some lot of great options here. I like Plex a lot. Plex is one of my favorite all-in-one streaming apps that in addition to live channels offers hundreds of movies and TV shows as well. So you can click up here in the different categories, brands, uh, you'll see all the different categories that Plex offers for free movies. If I click brands, you'll see all the brands that Plex offers for free movies. So Plex, guys, just another great option to stream free content on your Roku device. But that's it. That's just a quick tutorial on how you can set up live TV to get access to hundreds of free live channels on any Roku device. Now, the very final thing I wanna show you, like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, is if for some reason you do not have this live TV guide available, you will need to run a system update. So how to do that is from the home menu, scroll down, hover over settings, and then if I hover over settings, I'm going to scroll down, and then I'm gonna hover over system. And then once you hover over system, scroll down and you'll see an option for software update. So I'm gonna click software update. And then I'm gonna click check now. And then you'll see I do have an update available. You may not have an update available, but if you do have one available, I would just click update now. And this is going to update your Roku software. And ideally this should get you that live TV guide app that I showed you at the beginning of this video. So you can start you know, opening it up and watching live channels instantly. So that's it guys. Again, this is Bodie with IPTV Wire. Appreciate you all watching this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Like this video if you found this helpful. Guys, also be sure to leave me a comment below if there's any live TV applications that you guys are using on your Roku devices that I may have missed in this video. So guys, I hope you all have a great day.